Welcome to KVX's demonstration of bolted wear parts installation utilising a KVX hydraulic tool. Always follow KVX safety precautions and any relevant local regulations. Prepare the wear plate. All surfaces must be clean and free of debris. Apply grease on the bolt threads. Do not forget to also grease the cones. Apply grease in all holes. Use only KVX grease, Molly Pan N, or a KVX approved grease. Install the ball dowels where applicable for one bolt systems. Place the wear plate in position. Insert the bolt and tighten manually. Install the front protector list. Apply grease in the tooth holes. Only KVX grease or a KVX approved grease have the correct resistance coefficient. Install the dowel balls where applicable for one bolt systems. Place the tooth in position. Insert the bolt and tighten manually. Check the KVX torque table to know the torque to apply for each bolt size. First, the bolt must be pre-torqued. Apply 5% of the final specified torque value indicated in the table as the pre-torque value. To pre-torque, use a torque wrench or the hydraulic tool for larger bolt sizes. For smaller bolt sizes M48 to M60, it can also be acceptable to pre-torque manually by hitting with a copper mallet on a spanner installed on the bolt until it stops. Then use the hydraulic tool to tighten the wear part. Two methods are available. The torque turn method, an angle reference, or the hydraulic pressure setting method, a pressure reference. KVX recommends to use both methods simultaneously. Place the drive socket and the reaction socket on the bolt pair. For one bolt systems, use the KVX reaction pin instead of a reaction socket. Lower the hydraulic torque tool, mating the drive socket first, then the reaction socket or the reaction pin. Draw a mark on the bolt and draw on the tool the additional angle specified to apply to obtain the final torque. Tighten until the two marks meet. Also monitor the hydraulic pressure throughout. Check the marks and check the pressure. There should be a reasonable correlation. The wear part is ready. Remove the hydraulic torque tool, then follow the same procedure with the other bolts.